Excuse me, technical difficulties. NVIDIA's GeForce being its usual uh, temperamental self. Right, anyway, here we are. The Escorts got released shortly after I posted the video last night. As I was expecting. Um, so we've got the Ford Escort RS 1600 RC racing version anyway um, which is from Exelia 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 and the skins done by Wolf and it goes in with the pack by Fred from the flash with the Mercedes-Benz 300 SEL blah 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 anyway without further ado let's go it just sent to my view get in first and hit it so first away these are in two separate classes but the auto qualification for a, a mixed class race you can see that the uh, the big Merc is in here with the escorts so lap times are very comparable now just like the old style of racing You've got the lightweight, nimble, but low-powered cars up against some boat-like monsters which will eat you on the straights. I've got one such monster behind me, I'm coming onto one such straight. Now, as a safety net, that monster has got to get around all the other cars. Here he comes. Hello. <laughs> and he's terrible in the corner, so we can just get back at him. And this is the racing. So I've got the AI set to uh, 110 and medium, which is about right for me with mod cars, with the AI. So I need to get in with this uh, with this pack of escorts in front. Now I have done a little bit of a testing just to check it out. Um, whereby I take the escort out for a few laps, then I immediately jump into the Mercedes for a few laps, just to see how comparative they are for. Um, time-wise and racing against each other and they are perfect spot on don't change your thing uh, you had to close the gap before it was going to stay wide so the skins by wolf are absolutely fantastic did them pretty quick the amount of cars they've done for 22 and um, all high res as you can see very uh, period correct, they all look the business. He's going to come up the inside of me here. It's really terrible at multitasking, so when I'm talking to you guys, uh, yeah, knock a bit of time off my, uh, my lap. Excuse me a second. <coughs> okay, leave it in fourth. So, how do the cars handle? Um, he says running wide and getting into a tank slapper uh, they handle fantastic when somebody can drive them drives them properly car models are, are perfect uh, I've been lifted from PC2 um, they are they feel light they feel nimble don't feel massively overpowered but they've got plenty of oomph to get them going Plenty of grip, just got to watch that back end. But you haven't got a huge amount of power, so you're not going to kind of uh, light the rears up and, uh, unless you're really pushing hard. He says locking the uh, brake again. Okay, I'm going to stay wide this time. And, uh, they heard me, they heard me. The car is booked. 
supposed to go and cover the inside line, not stay out here with me. But again, these are the kind of the original touring cars. And the, uh, the racing style is, well, touring cars all the way. Drop it to second, get a tighter line. Just hook it in. Did nothing for me, but it was spectacular anyhow. So it looks like the uh, there's a Merc that's run away up there. I'm in this gaggle of escorts and there's a little gaggle behind me keeping the Mercs at bay behind me. I really need to get myself through these guys. Cut it tight, cut it tight. There we go. Again, these libraries are just absolutely beautiful. Tight again. So back my nose out the yellow car the inside second stuck in shove me way through fourth late break dodge the guy in front drop it to third in a horrible position here here's a merc two mercs so we'll get to see the uh, the power of those mercs their uh, comedy cornering skills still at the side of me get down to second bit of blipping on the throttle of course both of these are uh, rear wheel drive even in third go deep Second, tighten it up, tighten it up, make some gap on these here before they get on that straight. Okay, force feedback coming off, it is fantastic. Lots of uh, feedback of what the car's doing. Also, my inputs into the car are all as you'd expect. We'll try and find some other uh, cars to race in this series. I think there is going to be a few actually. With a little bit of fiddling will work. Yeah, we're back up on them. That's how it works, you see. You get up on them on the uh, in the corners. Just drive around them here. Well, I would do if the bolt wasn't in front of me. And then you get on a bit of a straight. <laughs> and you have a problem. Again, we're on a corner. Now, if I can just split these two no I haven't, I haven't got enough here he comes and the more corners that come the more chances I have of getting round them then I can block I see how slow he's going round there that's a first but wow Love seconds, I need to cut it really tight, punch out of there. So, yeah, he's pulling away up here. That neck is not going to be cutting up. Look, he is, he's inside of me. There we go, foreshadowing. He's not going to be cutting up the inside of me, clunk. Right, no chance on the straight, get behind the old biff. I carry as much speed as I can, I've got more grip, as you can see. Take advantage of the uh, twisty bit of the circuit. I'll break him, go up the inside, he's trying to cover it. Not going to work. They do like to be thrown around these things. He's back on me. Whoa, I nearly overcooked it there on the brakes. Another Merc in front and gaggle of escorts up there. I'm not going to hold this guy at bay. Wow. So when you're racing the Mercs against the escort, it is kind of 
get around those corners, hold on to dear life. And you get on the straight and just hit the loud pedal. Oh, he's gone wide. We'll take advantage of that by going wide ourselves. We'll power a bit early. Go on, a look. Last lap. Oh dear. There again, he comes absolutely hammering in there. He can't hold it here, mind you. He drops back again. And now he's got the straight to absolutely uh, annihilate me. I'm going to keep the inside line. If you ram me way before we get to the bend, though. Okay, where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Ah, oh, no, 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 no. My bad. I thought he was going to drift out wide and he just kept it tight. Drifted out wide that time. Don't worry, he wouldn't have even felt that in that tank. So, in other news, as we get to the end, uh, I've had a. Oh gosh, I've had a, uh, an email for a dev uh, with a free key to do a bit of a video. Exciting stuff. I'm gonna go and try the uh, try the game and see if it's. Uh, well, it's well known. It's a well known VR title. I'll leave it at that. Surprises to come. Anyway, adios. I'll leave the uh, link to the description of this. Link to the description. Yeah, it's a car rowing. There you go. You've descriptive it here. In perfect describing manner. Um, I'll leave a link to the car in the description below. I always get that messed up. Don't know what it is. And uh, yeah, go fill your boots. They are absolutely fantastic. I will find something to throw in this class. I think the 2002 BMWs will fit perfectly in there. But anyway, enjoy. Another cracking mod. Adios.